Two years ago, a barn went up in flames at a community farm, causing them to have to shut down a program that helps kids and adults with disabilities. Tonight, the barn is close to being fully restored. NBC 5's Blake McHugh tells us how the therapeutic program kept pushing through and is continuing to help others. It was a very traumatic and devastating experience. In July of 2017, the August Moon Farms barn burned down to the ground. They suspected a box fan. The farm runs the program Healing Hearts and Hooves, or HHH, but the fire left the program without the proper necessities to keep running. We lost all of our grain, medications, all of our stuff for our horses. HHH helps students with disabilities or difficult backgrounds receive the support they need by working with horses. When the barn burned down, they had to stop the healing program, but it wasn't for long. We did shut down temporarily that summer, mm -hmm. and then we did start classes back up. It was a little different doing it without the barn, but we didn't want our students to go without. It was an adjustment, but board members knew they needed to keep the program afloat for their students, like Brooke Davis. She is a little miracle baby, so she's had four brain surgeries and a spinal surgery all before a year. The therapy helps with developing her brain, like communicating and multitasking. In order to keep the program up and running, it came with some adjustments, like keeping their horses outdoors 24-7. But it made it all worth it, knowing they were able to keep helping those that needed it. Her coming here has helped so much, like therapy wise, for her in many ways, like for physical therapy wise, mental, and everything. Like she's starting to talk more at home and developmentally growing and progressing a lot. The barn that started out like this now looks like this and should be finished by the end of the summer so HHH can once again run at full capacity. In Cave Junction, Blakely McHugh, NBC5 News.